No, I had to do some add-ons and takeaways and reconstruct this because you already know over here on Bible TV, we do our story time. And yes, we're going to get off into it, but y'all, before we get off into it, you know I had to put up the copyright claim. That's just on period. 107 of the Copyright Act allowance is made for fair use for the purpose of criticism and comments and news reporting. You know what it is. It's all about Peach McIntyre. And we have got to open up this story to really analyze and look into the details of what's really going on. So let me get my story book. You see, when I take a look at this young lady here, Peaches, and that's her name. That's her actual name. Look, I can't help but to say, here's a woman that strive to be totally different, okay? And that's just on period. She named her kids after Gregory McKay, all affirmation names. And it's a reminder of who she is. I'm going to say that. Now, the kids going to learn to adapt to their names as they get older. You got names like Phenomenal. You got Gorgeous. You got Amazing. You got Choice. It's all about the choices she made, right? Wonderful. She wonderful. That's the way she see herself. And those going to be reminders for her kids to adapt to as they grow older and accept themselves. And I get the concept. Right? But baby, social media is taking over when it comes to this eviction. Thank you got so people laughing heart and or, um, sniggling and me, making videos, so copying behind each other. Just to piggyback off the fact that this woman is being evicted as they see it. But baby, I told y'all two months ago or over 30 days plus that this woman rent was not paid. I told y'all that in the whole video, but it's brand new to a whole lot of people supposedly. Just pay attention because see, I she don't mind school. letting you know. So bad. So thank y'all so much. And I'm gonna go ahead from there and show you the video. You see, it was that video that I went on and told people, can you imagine what just happened? And I told you the rent was due. And that was more than three weeks ago. I kid you not. So this information is not news to me. Now where they're going, I have no idea. But we all know over here on Bieber's channel that rent was not being paid. And that's just on period. She wasn't giving up any rent. So eviction means nothing when you know you're not paying the rent. So when Peach was traveling with her child, and I do mean her child, not with Woods, okay? Because clearly you can see McKay is riding the front seat as a passenger. All of a sudden, we saw pictures of a vacant home. Now, whether she's moving into a home or it's the old home that she's cleaning out, we don't have clarification of that. But I will say this. God is always in the blessing business. And for her to make such a statement, take a listen. Yes, I'm leaving this city. I can't yes, help but to wonder yes. if her travels with McKay was going to see a new apartment because you know she came up with these cookies and she mentioned her 20-piece set from TikTok. Make it make sense, y'all. This lady should already have pots and pans. So as we hear her speak, we see that she's making these changes. I'm, I'm inclined to believe she's making a change. She's always said that she wasn't going to deal with Woods in certain situations. And maybe this is a new start for her. But when CPS came out and interfered in her life the way it did, that shook everything up. That shook up people's pockets, starting with the housing people. And that's just on period. People are going to respect their privacy some kind of way. And that's what I'm going to have to say. This is Bieber TV. I thank you because see what Peach put on social media is really her life, what she's going through. And P 
people are going to speculate and giggle and laugh and different things like that. But baby, you can't get in the way of God. And that's just what it is. Peace, love, and happiness to you all. Stay tuned.